Good evening, everyone. How are y'all doing? Hope you all had a wonderful day. Uh, it was a crazy day today for me. Uh, helped a lot of kids get their iPads going and uh, definitely put in a full day and I'm feeling it now. So the reason I wanted to come to you tonight was to kind of um, talk about a few things. Uh, the first one is eating when you're working out. Um, I'm a firm believer that just because you want to lose weight doesn't mean you have to cut out a bunch of food. doesn't mean you have to stop eating something. Um, you know, a lot of people have said, oh, well, you still eat pizza and you eat hamburgers and you eat steaks. It's no wonder you're not losing weight. Um, yeah, I am. Uh, I weigh under 230 pounds coming down from 266 and I eat whatever I want, but it doesn't mean you don't have to be careful, okay? So, everything, of course, is in moderation. And yes, I do firmly believe that because, um, you know, obviously if you eat too much, you can gain weight. Um, if you don't fuel your body the right way, that could have a negative effect too. So, I'm not saying don't be careful. I'm just saying you don't have to cut everything out in order to lose weight but you have to be willing to put in the work so um, as I'm getting ready to start a completely different workout routine um, you know I just I have to keep in mind that I've got to be able to fuel my body if I'm gonna make it through the day and unfortunately I haven't worked out in a while so uh, I'm definitely starting to feel the effects I'm extremely exhausted right now uh, I'm not sleeping real well, which definitely has, uh, not working out has an effect on. Um, I can function this way, don't get me wrong. Uh, I actually used to be able to sleep for two hours a night, and I could go for two, three hours, or two, three days without sleep. And that wasn't working for me either. Um, so just when you're, when you're starting to live a healthier lifestyle, think about what you're eating. Think about fueling your body instead of filling it with things that are just trying to <coughs> excuse me just trying to fill the empty space okay now the other side of this is um the average person the last statistic i heard said that the average person should be eating anywhere from between five and six times a day okay three meals two or three two or three snacks and a lot of people think well that's a lot of food well not really if you think about it you're eating three square meals okay in between breakfast and lunch have a small snack uh, you know, a piece of fruit um, a granola bar uh, something to hold you over until you have lunch okay um, between lunch and dinner have another one to hold you over until you get to uh, dinner and then I said five or six times if you start to feel hungry before you go to bed excuse me have a small snack, okay? Have like a bowl of Cheerios or or something that will help your body essentially during the night, okay? You know, something with protein in it. Um, not, definitely not anything real heavy, okay? Me, myself, if I need something before I go to bed, I will have one of my protein shakes, okay? It, it fills me up just enough. That I'm not going to bed hungry, but I'm not going over to bed overly full. On top of which, my protein has a lot of stuff in it that will help my body repair after a workout so I'm not quite as sore when I wake up the next morning. Okay, so just think about the things that you're putting in your body when, when you eat throughout the day. Okay, um, you know, I when I started this journey, um, I, I was at 266 pounds and I could sleep uh, at the drop of a hat, okay? I could stop anywhere and I was out cold. I hated it. I had no energy, couldn't do anything, uh, couldn't hardly hang out with my kid at night. Drove me nuts. Now, I work out during the day. I'm gonna start running again too, so uh, definitely will have the energy I need to get through the day. Now, my buddy Trevor, uh, who's kind of my running coach, one of them anyway, tells me that he wants me to start running in the morning that I should be doing two a days well that's all well and good and I'm not saying that I won't but that's not me right now okay I don't 
I don't work I don't run that much okay and to be quite honest with you I can't run a full mile yet I can run half a mile can't run a full so if you follow me on Facebook or you follow me on Under Armour or you follow me on Twitter and you see that I'm doing 4.2 miles in an hour no I'm not running the full thing okay look at me I still got a ways to go here okay I'm not running a marathon yet doesn't mean though that someday maybe I won't uh, the Shackley Global Conference actually has a 5k in it and with me going to conference next year I would like to be able to run a 5k and keep a decent time okay so but I've got to build up to that so like I said when you're when you're eating think about what you're eating think about fueling your body instead of just filling an empty space because you're hungry okay um, next thing I want to talk to you guys about is stress okay I know people say that oh well you know I'm not under that much stress and I'm doing just fine and the next thing you know they have died uh, from uh, putting their body under too much so if you find yourself under too much stress start looking for stress relievers okay um, you know there I know don't get me wrong that it's frowned upon to take a break at work but you know what I'm sorry if you're gonna push me over the edge I'm walking away for a little bit I need some time to just decompress get my mind right before I'm able to function well enough to help others okay um, I work in the IT field and quite frankly it for the most part it is a thankless job and I'm okay with it because some of the problems that I come across challenge my knowledge of computers and allow me to really kind of think about the problem and figure out what I need to do uh, I used to have a boss that said um, oh here come here comes my crazy dog um, I, I used to have a boss that said that uh, whenever I asked him a question his first question back to me was well what did Google say so um, you know I learned to do Google searches um, before asking for help because you know that that was my job I, I was expected to try and find a solution before I went to my boss hang on just a second y'all um, before I went to my boss um, asking him for questions Mac Mac hey um, y'all excuse me for just a minute I gotta try and get my dog here real quick inside Mac Mac <laughs> y'all excuse me for that so um, you know if, if you think you're not under a lot of stress think about what you go through in the course of a day Mac um, sorry folks uh, I'll tell you what I'll, I'll be back in just a bit